Mirage is a group theory-based multi-scale simulation toolkit that enables the inverse design of metamaterials exhibiting exotic electromagnetic behaviors beyond the limits of conventional optics. Mirage allows you to say, here is the behavior I want. What does it look like? Help me build it, give me a template to fill, or just give me a library that I can download from and tweak upon. It removes the need for a team of tens of people with vastly different expertise. Um, you would have needed a mathematician, a physicist, an electromagnetics expert, a material scientist, just put them all in the same room to get one metamaterial out. It takes metamaterial design from this arena of your own intuition and a lot of trial and error to being able to purposely design something that you want. And then it also allows you to optimize under a framework that as long as you stay within a certain symmetry group, you know that you can get the behavior you want, as opposed to accidentally sort of leaving that, uh, that uh, realm, if you will, and going into space where you'll actually never get the answer you want. You may be tweaking something that's just not going to be there. You're, you're, you're chasing a mirage, which is where we got the word for our software from. But the reality is, to intuition-based design is not the way to go. You want to, be, you want to be able to say, here's the behavior I want, and what does the metamaterial have to look like? Man-made optical metamaterials, known for exhibiting exotic behaviors impossible with natural materials, have often been touted as the technology that will someday enable flat, compact lenses, smaller satellites, and cloaking devices. When you have a tool that is intended to be given to anywhere from uh, college students to top of the field academics, um, you need to have the availability of that tool to be responsive to their needs. The tool has been able to allow them to discover maybe some of the things that they've created in the lab, why it's behaving in the way that it is, um, without having to run a simulation or even uh, put anything on silicon. It's fast. Um, it's portable, we have it run on a laptop as well as on a workstation, and the more power you give it, the faster it is on an average laptop. A calculation step takes less than a minute. Uh, compare it to other tools that I've used, um, it, it would have taken hours, if not half a day, to get a step through. It is recognized that there is a shortfall of computational approaches for metamaterials, which is why DARPA is funding this project. I think the impact will be that we've never before had a, a tool which allows us to systematically understand how the shapes and structures of these sub-wavelength scale atoms perform when you group them together. The interactions between them are very complicated. Uh, what this tool allows you to do is find shapes and structures that A, you can make, and B, when you assemble them into a material, have the bulk properties that you need. And Mirage is not limited to cubic tiles. It can handle parallelograms, hexagonal, prism, and octagonal shapes. Now metamaterials is everybody's game. Everybody can come in and design a metamaterial and get it to work. That's what the objective of Mirage was. It's fulfilling the whole, that big gap in how tools uh, that did metamaterials existed. No guesswork, no tediousness, uh, no pain, no multi um, cross disciplinary expertise that you have to have, no huge research teams. Now you just have to have your imagination and idea, and, and the tool will do the rest.